Okay, this video here is going to be taking a look at the stream tab, which is kind of like your default tab when you uh, are in Google Classroom. So the stream pretty much is think of it like a a Facebook feed for your for your Google Classroom. So uh, the stream will show if you have it set up will show any assignment that you've posted or any announcement. So the stream pretty much when you're in the stream here is pretty much for giving quick announcements to students. So at the very top here you'll see your profile picture and it says share something with your class. You can just type a quick message. You can um, you can attach uh, files to your to your message, but this is not something you would do to collect work from students. You can start a discussion this way. Um, a variety of things that you can do with uh, with this. So, for example, here, if I just click in here, I may just want to do like a welcome message. Welcome to our online classroom. <clears throat> you, you could probably put some some basic norms and rules. Please. <clears throat> Please only post positive messages in a stream. If I wanted to add, you know, a file from Drive for them to look at, a link to a website, a file that's saved on my computer or a YouTube video, I could. Um, that that is an option to you. And then you would uh, just hit post. And that in a nutshell is pretty much the basic purpose of stream. So if you've seen any of the other videos here, these if it says here posted a new assignment or new material, these are things that I actually posted in classwork and they also show up in my stream. And the most recent posts are always at the top. The older posts go to the bottom.